Hey, Troy. Hey, how's it going? Great. What brings you in? Coffee. Coffee. Well, look around and I'll have it ready for you in a whiff. Perfect. Thanks. My pleasure. You can be basically whatever you want to be here in Miami. You just let your imagination grow and you just go with it. The art community here is open and large. You know, it's just a place for you to explore art and see what you can achieve and dream big. I'm Troy Simmons, and this is my Miami. With my projects, I try to make sure people can see myself and also see some of the work that I am doing, and then, you know, so that little kids in some of the little communities that can come out and see the artworks. It's something that you can actually achieve, you know, in Miami, it just opens the door for that. You have all these different places that you can go and explore art, you know, most of the time it's free, where everyone, families, people in all the communities can come out and enjoy the arts. I start off really structured, 3D renderings, drawings, and things like that, and then I freely like break them off. I'll take a hammer and I'll crack them up, I'll throw them, I'll burn them, I'll do whatever it takes to destroy those things. And it releases stress and pressure within me, and it also gives the piece its own personality. It gives it its own life. Coming from Texas, moving to Miami, it was a culture shock in a way for me. You know, I was around people from different locations in the world, uh, coming from different backgrounds, and I grew up with different expectations than I have. And so what the colors represent is just that melting pot of all the people coming together and really just living in one community or living in one location together. Journey with Coffee started off a few years ago. I was preparing for a show, and it was one of those long nights. Never really been a big STEM guy but I decided to go ahead and jump into coffee. And probably about two years now, I've been a coffee connoisseur. I started off uh, making milkshakes, basically. It was just put too much sugar, too much cream in it, and, and then you know, I had people tell me, hey, that's not the way you're supposed to drink your coffee. So I had to back off of that, and I'm, I'm still learning and exploring. It draws back to my, my curiosity of, of just learning and meeting you know, new people and, and, and exploring new things. What do you think? Wow, it's, uh, it's really good. I can uh, catch the uh, citrus. Good catch, because what I chose for you today is the Master Origin Ethiopia. Yeah. And we light roast it, so we can actually work and push for those flavors to forward in that cup. But it has a freshness about it. I'm, I'm picking that up, it's really good. Really a good taste. Since I've been here, it feels like I'm in a community. You know, if I, if I meet someone and I want to explore a different type of food that I haven't had, a different coffee I haven't had, people are open to share their cultures with you. So, and I feel like that's community once you have that type of establishment and relationship with people. It just kind of opens the door and people are open and willing to really share what they're about.